Welcome to another video. This one might be a 20 minute minute video, but I'll try to keep it short. Uh, this one is going to be interesting since it's a full body picture and this thing is a gas monster, looks like to me. But uh, again, going to do shapes and go from there. This one, I'm either going to try to like crop out some of his body maybe, but I'll try to fit everything in. Uh, and it's not, it's like, well, I can, you know, squeeze things up, but it won't look natural, it'll look weird. I think that's that all. Alright, I see. I see what this thing is. There's a little remnants of humanity in him. Also, I didn't. I don't think I mentioned it in any other videos. Um, if you have any, uh, like requests on what I should draw next, feel free, and make him serious, I don't want like, you know, oh, penises, <laughs> because like, that's not really something I want to draw, but I want to draw like something, you know, cool, if you want me to draw like Metal Gear characters, like Ocelot, Cyborg Ninja, whatever, sure, Mario characters, whatever, you name it, I will draw it, and we'll have some fun, I can talk to you, you guys, you can talk back, I'll you respond to stuff, you tell me, and I'll do it. Um, because to me, I think, you know, if I if it's like more like, you know, tell me what to draw and I'll do it, it's going to be more fun, and then, you know, if, you know I could set, uh, set things up, and I can do more crazy stuff, and then it'll be fun. It'll be fun for everyone. Every single person. Every single one. All right. So, yeah, I, his feet got a little cut off, but, um, I don't really think, no, I don't think anyone's gonna cry over that. Besides feet lovers out there, you know, and you know who you are, guys, <laughs> Uh, I think I'm pretty, I'm pretty okay with his arm being where it is. This is gonna be weird, because, like, this is, it's, this thing isn't, like, a solid being. I don't know how to draw that. But whatever, I'll just no do my best. I made a little mistake, but whatever. It's life. Welcome to life, guys. Mistakes happen. Ooh. But I mean, to, and to me, it's like yeah, you can tell me. You could always, you know, uh, sketch it out. But that to me, what doesn't really do anything. Like, it's it's weird. It's it's a weird way I work. It's just like I can't. You know, sketch things for a while, and then... Like, I can do it sometimes, but it's like... In the play map... In the... Especially on the play map, there's more stuff that's going on that... Yeah, they can't really... They can do all this on paper easily, because I can do a lot more stuff. This is more, like, limiting. Like, I'm not even kidding. There's stuff that I... That, you know, I'm struggling with on this thing. But, um... That's not saying that, you know... But it's just, it's harder because it's like it's a thing I'm not used to drawing on. Uh, there's a lot more stuff going on. Whatever. And, and I'm pretty satisfied with this. I like so far. I, I don't think it's gonna be the best, but I don't think it's gonna be bad. I don't think it's gonna be bad. I mean, hey, this I might like in the end. I'll you know a lot of things can change. Things can happen. Oh, not this song. Fuck that. Another fun fact about me is uh, my brother loves Sailor Moon. Well, 
I guess loved. I'm not sure if he loves it still. But, um... It's funny because I watched that, I was watching that recently on Nostalgia. Like, well, not recently, it was a while ago. Um, and they're just wondering, you know, maybe maybe I will like it, I don't know. And, yeah, I think the people who made that show were high. I, or, you know, on LSD or, or anything, anything. I mean, they could have just been on, like, heroin for all I know. Because it was so trippy. Like, they're like, okay, because, like, uh, I was... It starts out with like the, the main character playing a video game, and the video game character design looks a lot like Sailor Moon. Guess that was foreshadowing, but whatever. And it was, and then she became looking like that. So it's like, so is the video game, you know, true? Then I don't know. It's weird. It's a weird thing, and you know, like even the the concept that what goes on is pretty weird. Like there's a arc. One of my favorite, like, I will say when I was a kid, um, my brother loved watching it, so I was stuck watching it because I was waiting for Dragon Ball Z or Reboot or whatever. And uh, there was one, like, um, arc that they did where, um, what's it called? They do, um, like, they're trying to find, like, this thing in people's dreams, so they search their dreams and whatever. Like, it's, that is so hard to explain because it, it is really as if someone who was, there was like, yo man, what if a guy, like, a, a bad guy wants to go inside people's dreams and then, like, they want to, they're looking for something in their dreams, in their personal dreams, and then, you know, change them for, it was so weird. And, uh, you know, they got away with it because kids were dumb, I guess, but, um, yeah, I, I, for some reason, I liked that arc a lot more because there was, I don't know what it was. I think it was, you know, oh, this is pretty cool. But then, uh, still, it had that, you know, druggy kind of, uh, thing. It was weird. It was weird. It's a weird show. I, I hate it. I hate that show so much. Like, it was like, oh, who's Tuxedo to Max? School? So, I don't know. I don't like it. Uh, if you like it, that's good for you. I really don't like it. Another anime that I ended up watching, at, just out of irony, I, or facetiousness, whichever you want to call it, was, um, what's it called? Oh, it's escaping. Oh, and Inuyasha, I was watching that on Dulce when I was a kid. And that show, man, like, when I got older, I started realizing a lot of flaws with the story, and like, not, with the sto not flaws with the story, but just like, dumb, dumb stuff, like, the main move that the main character uses is the same move regardless like there's an episode where he learned a new move called like the wind barrier or something whatever the fucking shit was and then other episodes as it went on became the wind scar it literally became the wind scar and I was like what the fuck like they didn't explain you know maybe there was a reason why it became the wind scar no it just became the wind scar and I was like are you fucking kidding me not even gonna explain that and it was like yeah man it's the wind scar it's like no no you had an episode, develop this new technique, and then you're just gonna merge it with... The w okay, and you can argue saying, oh, it's uh, translation stuff, and no, there's no way it's a translation error, to, in my opinion. But whatever, it was, it was just... That, to me, pissed, kind of pissed me off when I, when I saw that. I was like, are you fucking kidding me? Uh, and I thought, always thought the, the romance with Kagome and Yasha were just, you know, beating around the bush, and... It was like, we all know they, they're gonna be together, come on, let's, let's do it. And I thought that she was a bitch, as well. I mean, she just kept treating him like an, like an asshole. Like, a, like, a little, like, a, she just treated him like shit the entire time. And he was like, yo, man, oh man, she treated me like shit, I'm still her friend though. And it's like, are, are you kidding me? Like, dude, I think there was even an episode where he didn't, no he did nothing wrong. He would, and then she was like, oh, well, fuck you. And I was like, are you fucking kidding me? He's just sitting there, and you're being like, shit, okay. <sighs> Whatever. Okay, well, I'm gonna try to keep this. So I'll edit here, and pick up next time. See you in the next vid.